In this video, we'll cover utilizing the mCity Skyline web application to manually control infrastructure at the mCity test facility. Utilizing Skyline, we can control many aspects of a test facility right from a web interface. Let's dive in and control an intersection. Skyline's main screen consists of a map and a floating menu showing attributes of each object on this map. By clicking on the intersection icon, Skyline has opened the drop-down for the intersection of Liberty and Pontiac. On the left-hand side of the screen, a user can view the remaining time in a phase of the traffic light, the current color, and the overall state of the intersection. We're going to change the intersection to a night flash state. We'll click on the flash button and watch as the intersection changes in real time. Once the intersection is in a flashing state, we'll click the button again to change the intersection back to its normal timing plan. Notice that the button in Skyline has updated to indicate the current state of flashing at the intersection. The timing to enter and exit night flash will be controlled by the traffic signal controller at the intersection. Skyline can also be used to not just perform manual one-time configurations of infrastructure, but also scriptable sequences which can be used to define vehicle testing scenarios.